Bill Gates believes in this penny stock, but is it worth the buy? What's up you guys, Darabu here, back for more stocks news. Today we're gonna analyze this company called Denison Mines Corporations, ticker symbol DNN. As I'm recording this video right now, it's currently sitting at $1.04. And I'll let you know why is it undervalued and why is it worth the buy at the end of the video. So do remember to keep watching till the end. Also do check out my stocks videos in the descriptions if you're interested in learning about stocks and crypto in an entertaining way. Also once we hit 5,000 subscribers, I will be giving out 5,000 Dogecoin so do remember to subscribe. Let's start it off here. This company is a uranium exploration and development company with interest focused in the Antabesca Basin region of northern Saskatchewan. This location is basically in Canada. Now I'm just going to highlight on the main points why this company is so undervalued. Nuclear has been around for ages and is one of the best energy generations out there. If you take a look at the charts from 1957 to 2019, US nuclear electricity generation capacity and generation from the year 1957 all the way up to 2019, it grew exponentially. MWH is mega kilowatts and 1 mega kilowatt is basically 1 million watt. As you can see, the generation is sitting at 850,000 megawatts. And this says right here, nuclear power plants are generally used more intensively than other power plants. For cost and technical reasons, nuclear power plants are generally used more intensively than coal or natural gas-fired power plants. In 2019, the nuclear share of total US electricity generating capacity was 9%, while the nuclear share of total electricity generation was about 20%. They mentioned that a fixed uranium price of $44 per pound will produce a combined pre-tax project of $1.4 billion. And why did I mention about Bill Gates in the very beginning? It's because in CNBC, Bill Gates did announce that nuclear power will absolutely be politically acceptable again. It's safer than oil, coal and natural gas. And if Bill Gates does mention it in the CNBC article, it's very likely to be true. Above all the details, I would like to look at their financials. One thing I love to see about the company's financials is that cash only is $25 million at 2020. And the next thing I like seeing is that their total current liabilities is at $11.8 million. In these cases, we don't look at the total liabilities, but the total current liabilities. Therefore, the cash ahead is more than double of its liabilities, which is a really good sign to me. It is definitely undervalued. But I'm not saying that this company does not have any risk. Because if this project doesn't pull through, this company might take a huge, huge, huge dip and they might lose a lot of investors. And I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial news. This is purely for your entertainment. If you like to buy a stock, go ahead. And I'm going to put a bit of money in this stock. But let me tell you, this is a high risk, high return stock. Once again, do smash the like button if you enjoyed watching this video. And with all that said, thank you so much for watching. And I'm going to sip my coffee now. See you guys next time. Peace out.